welcome into this video where I have set up five different ninja PowerPoint tricks which you should know if you want to become better at PowerPoint. Number one, setting as default shape. If you have a nice presentation, you are doing something, you are having a nice color scheme and then each time when you insert a new shape, it's always, always, always this ugly blue with an ugly outline around it. This is easily overcome by right clicking on any of your existing objects and here clicking set as default shape. From now on, each shape that you add into this presentation will have this exact settings, this nice color scheme. Number two, copying over slides. Now, I know that plenty of you already know about this, but you can copy easily slides between two PowerPoints. For example, I have here an icon set, which I prepared for my students in my premium courses. And I can simply click here, press Ctrl C or Command C if you are on a Mac. Click here on this presentation, just press Ctrl V. I can even click this and keep the source formatting to have the same background. And I have now this slide within my presentation. I can quickly grab any icon, place it here on this slide since these are also vector icons, I can shape fill, I can eye drop, and I can use the same color. And I have very quickly unique icons prepared in this slide because I copied them over to this presentation. As you already saw, number three will be the eye dropping outside of PowerPoint. Since PowerPoint 2013, which means 2016, 19, Office 365, and any newer version, you have the eye dropper in PowerPoint shape format, shape fill, eyedropper. I can click down the eyedropper and I can select any color I have. But what not everyone does know, while you have your mouse clicked, you can go outside the window of PowerPoint and you can select any color from your entire monitor. Number four for this video will be the size in pixels. Let's say that you have this element and you are designing something and you would like this to be exactly 300 by 300 pixels. You are going to the size options and you're like, how to do this? Well, pretty simple. You can type in 300, press space and press PX. It will automatically convert to inches. As you can see, I can press 400 PX and I have a perfect 300 per 400 element. A tip for pros, a normal PowerPoint A tip for pros, a normal PowerPoint slide is 1600 PX by 900 PX. So 1600 by 900 is the regular default PowerPoint slide dimension. All right, and number five will be advanced resizing, which is one of my absolutely favorite things to do. If you have an object selected and you are resizing it, if you press your left shift key, you will remain on constant proportions and it will always look the same. If you press your left control key additionally to the shift key, it will grow outside of its middle instead of just growing like this. So if you have shift and control, it grows outside. One other thing to notice, as you can see, it is snapping to all those objects which I have already here on the slide, which is sometimes a bit troublesome. So how to overcome this? is to press the left alt key and now everything works seamless. It doesn't snap to anything existing on this slide. So I can make this exactly the size I want without bothering with those other objects. This rounds up this video about five Ninja PowerPoint tricks in a few minutes. Thank you very much for watching. Let's see each other in the next iteration of those tricks. I hope I will bundle them together and we will have a variety and an awesome selection of great PowerPoint tricks to improve your skills right away. Thank you very much and see you next time.